What am I going to do this morning? Howdy folks, it's Nito with AP 2020 Outdoors. Welcome to the AP 2020 Outdoors Outdoor Shooting Range. Alright, got a fresh coat of paint on the Atlas Targets. Stay tuned. Alright folks, showing 612.2 yards. All right, folks, just to get you an idea what it looks like through the scope, the white is the kill zone on that Coyote target. I've got it right around 10 power, and to the tree line is 612 yards. Once again, I'm shooting standing up, so we'll see if I can get her done. Stay tuned. You guys want to check out some sweet merch? This is a Remington Deluxe Rifle Case. Got the old school quilted look. It's got a sweet uh, accessory pouch. And there's actually uh, probably the neodymium magnets. Pretty awesome, man. Got an awesome look, I'm telling you. Got the shoulder strap. Looks great, man. If it fits, it chips. Pretty nice. All right, 100 yards, 68 grain hammer, 100 tipped. 3,680 feet per second. Three shots into 0 0.364 inches, five shots into 0 0.719 inches. That's pretty awesome. Howdy folks, it's Nito with AP 2020 Outdoors. I'll tell you what, I was hoping to be able to take a seated position shot. However, those weeds, tall, I can't get over that corner because I'm gonna hit them weeds. And the way this land is laying, I'm about at the peak. If I go any further downhill, I won't be able to get over the weeds. Anyways, uh, it's going to be quite the challenge, folks. Uh, I don't know if you can tell. i got about a 15 to 20 mile an hour headwind. Unusual north wind, honestly, here in Ohio. But tell you what, folks, I'm up for the challenge. I've got the uh, Fax and Firearms FX7 Action 22250 Ackley Improved on the Graybo stock. Diligent Defense, Enticer LTI, of course I got the McGowan 2250 Remington Ackley Improved 1 and 7 twist. This should be fun. Alright folks, here we go, man, I don't know. <laughs> I may have reached my limit but you got to try you know shooter app is calling for 2.4 mils up at 612 yards I've got two tenths of a mil dialed uh, left let me get the uh, phone scope recording here standing position 612 yards I got a 15 to 20 mile an hour it's it's more like 1130 wind now I just took a I took a test shot first round hit I should have been recording and I don't know, here we go. All right, let's just see what happens. Here we go, trying to steady up. Oh, impact! <laughs> oh, man. I don't know, that was a pretty lucky shot, man. I'm like moving all over the place here. Impact! <laughs> oh yeah, it can be done, folks. You just gotta practice, I guess. Here we go. Impact! Oh yeah. I'll tell you what, this gives me some confidence now. Impact kill zone too. <laughs> oh, how to bullet stand by. All right, folks, I got the phone scope zoomed out, the spotting scope zoomed out, because I don't want to put you guys through all that vibration. But uh, I think I may be dialed. I'm going to send five shots right now. Here we go. Impact!
Impact! Impact! Impact! <laughs> I think I got one more. All right, here we go. Oh, there's a weed in my way. Get out of the way. There we go. Oh, there's a weed. Impact. All right, folks. <laughs> so, folks, I'm going to move up one, two, three. Three paces, probably about nine feet. I just need to get a clear shot around this corner. Hopefully I start hitting the targets more regularly. Alright folks, I'm scooted up a little bit. I definitely got a clean line of fire to the target now, no weeds. Here we go. No call. Impact! Oh, that you know, I, I think I've been shooting center mass on the target. That time I went right for the kill zone, and that's what I hit. Yeah, that's right in the kill zone. All right, stand by. I'm gonna aim right for the kill zone this time. I'm not gonna be aiming center mass on the coyote. Here we go. Well, hard telling. Once this wind's dying down, let me come back to zero on my windage. There we go, kill shot. All right, folks. So yeah, I was right. You know, I was uh, aiming center mass. I was hitting a little bit low. Of course, I think these were when I was trying to stand up and shoot. But then I started getting dialed in. I got one, two, three, four, five, six. Six in the kill, you know, almost seven there. And, you know, 612 yards, I mean, that's a poke to that far ridge, let me tell you. Anyways, all in all, I'm very happy with this uh, Hammer Hunter Tip 68 grain bullet at, you know, 3680. Yeah, that's almost 3,700 feet per second. Yeah, I think the uh, thermal is the next up on this rifle. Try to kill some Ohio coyotes. This is the RCBS Match Master Cedar Die for my 22250 Ackley Improved. Inline Cedar captures the case and the bullet. So my target COL is 2.715, so I have to come down another 14 thou. So here's the beauty of the micrometer adjust. Just come down 14 thou, 5, 10, 14, and we'll just see it further. So we'll come down another 14 thou. All right, folks, I've got some Remington 22-250. Premier AccuTip Varmint, 50 grain boat tail, muzzle velocity 3,800 feet per second. I've got my suppressor off. Why? Well, I'm doing the box test. This is a one and seven twist barrel. Uh, calculations are showing 411,000 RPM. Place your bets, folks. You think the bullet's going to stay together or come apart? All right, here we go. Taking the shot. <laughs> <laughs> Showing 3,830 feet per second out of this 28 inch barrel. Well, it might be all right, folks. I mean, it looks like it's staying together. All right, folks, so here's something cool. If you're in a pinch and you don't have any 22250 Ackley Improved cartridges, 
You can just buy a box of Remington Premier AccuTip, standard 2250, and you got a nice little fire form case right there. So I'll tell you what, upcoming video, I think I'll, I'll shoot these and uh, see how they do. I think they'll be okay in the can too. I'm kind of surprised. I figured 411,000 RPM, the bullets would have come apart. All right, folks, I'll tell you what, 22250 Ackley Proof can get it done, that's for sure. 68 grain hammers at 3,680 feet per second. I mean, for a 68 grain bullet, these babies are smoking fast. Time to put the thermal on this bad boy and shoot me some Ohio Coyotes. So this Neato with AP 2020 Outdoors, remember, support that Second Amendment. We'll see you later. Stay base. Thank you.